So my YouTube channel is about ski instruction and technique and learning and all that. Uh, obviously we're not skiing right now. Musicians are playing their music from home. I'll do my version of that from out here in the woods and share another story, life lesson that I learned through athletics. This is a story that changed my life, really. Uh, it was my first World Cup that I raced in. I was 17 years old, soon to turn 18. I was in Saalbach, Austria. My very first World Cup, it was a downhill. And uh, rookies start last. And in downhill, you take training runs before you actually race. So I started next to last, got to the bottom of the course and I won. I had the fastest time. And the Austrian media all swarmed around me. They were kind of freaking out. They wanted to know what my name was, how to spell it, where I was from. And uh, after that, I went and called my parents. Back in those days, we called Collect. And uh, so I said, I got them, I woke them up at home. And I said, you guys, mom and dad, I won my first training run on the World Cup. And uh, my dad was a psychologist at the University of Washington. And his answer was, Deb, that's awesome. How do you feel about that? Perfect psychologist response, right? I said, Dad, I feel great, but everyone around me is freaking out. And here's the punchline of the story. He said, Deb, you didn't know you weren't supposed to win. That right there changed my life because he was right. I didn't know what the rules, quote unquote, rules were. And so often we put ourselves in a box. We're the youngest child or we're the oldest child. We're a senior or we're a freshman. We're a rookie or we're the vet. We have these rules of how we're supposed to behave in uh, whatever box we place ourselves in. We're a girl, we're a boy. And I didn't know what the rules were. I didn't know uh, that I wasn't supposed to win. And so I did. I just let myself be and let my abilities just shine through and it changed my life. And from that point on, actually, I was really afraid to set goals because I was afraid my goals wouldn't be high enough. I didn't want my goals to set any parameters that could restrict me. What a concept, huh? That we wouldn't send our, set our goals high enough. So for about four years, I didn't set goals at all. I went out there every single day and just maximized the moment, maximized who I was and my ability and uh, let that determine where I was gonna go in life and in my ski racing career. That was a pretty important lesson. Let's go break trail, Charlie.